This is an ABC 10 News update. Hello, I'm Jim Patton with this ABC 10 News update. One person is dead in an investigation underway following an overnight fire at an apartment in El Cajon. First responders got to the complex on Mollison Avenue and immediately started evacuating people, pulling one man from a downstairs unit and he was taken to the hospital where he was pronounced dead. El Cajon fire officials tell us the fire stemmed from a domestic violence incident. And they believe the man who died is the one who uh, set the apartment on fire. Nobody else was injured, but residents were displaced. Governor Gavin Newsom is getting ready to speak to Californians in tonight's State of the State address. The governor is expected to talk about the cost of living, crime and homelessness, just to name a few of the items. This comes as Governor Newsom is heading into a re-election campaign. State of the State starts at 5 o'clock this evening. Well, today, the Port Commissioners will review and weigh in on a plan to redevelop Seaport Village. The plan includes a 500-foot observation tower, a new retail and restaurant space. Developers say they are trying to work around an earthquake fault that runs through the area. The project is expected to cost more than three billion dollars. Pictures look nice and let's hope they work around that fault really well. I know. I'm like, what? How do you do that? <laughs> we'll find sure. out. <laughs> <laughs> and today is a beautiful day to get out and enjoy the nice weather. Temperatures a little warmer today compared to yesterday. 60s and 70s for most of the county. Even some coastal areas will be in the 70s today with 50s in the mountains. The sea breeze returns this afternoon and that will actually usher in more clouds tomorrow ahead of a system that will bring a chance for some showers on Thursday. Also cooler temperatures as you can see over the next three days. So today, sunny skies, warm temperatures and dry breezy winds tomorrow, three to seven degrees cooler and a touch cooler on Thursday. Could see some drizzle in the morning out of the marine layer, but our better chance for some organized showers will be Thursday evening. Megan, thank you very much. And for the latest news, weather and traffic, go to 10news.com or download our free 10 News mobile app in your app store. For ABC 10 News, I'm Jim Patton.